boys and girls. Today we're going to talk about measuring length. We have two systems for measuring length, the U.S. customary and the metric. We're going to focus on the U.S. customary. So in order from smallest to largest, we use inches, feet, and yards. Let's talk about the inch. We can use the word inches after we have done finished measuring something. It is always important to put your unit of measure so that the person knows what you used when you were measuring. So you could write the word inches or you could use an abbreviation. Remember, an abbreviation is a shortened way of saying something. So if I wanted to abbreviate inches, I could say I in period. That represents the word inches. When your brain associates what an inch looks like, you can picture items such as a whistle, a paper clip, a knuckle, or a snap cube. Those are all things that are about an inch long. The tool that we use to measure inches would be a tape measure or a ruler. Let's take a look at feet. Feet is used to measure medium-sized objects. Again, you can use an abbreviation when you are using your unit of measure in feet. An abbreviation for feet would be FT period. When your brain pictures what a foot looks like, you could of course use a ruler because a ruler is one exact foot. You could also extend your arm and the length from your elbow to your wrist could be a foot. Also your math journal. The length of your book could be about a foot or an adult foot could be about a foot. So all of those things is what your brain could picture as what a foot looks like. The measurement tool that we use for feet is a ruler. We use a ruler to measure feet. If you're measuring longer items, you could also use a yard because a yard is three feet put together. Let's take a look at what a yard looks like. So again, when you're measuring, you want to have a label and you could use the word yard or you could have an abbreviation. A yard measures long objects or short distances. So the abbreviation for yard is YD period. Hang on a second, let me get that, there we go. Okay, let's try that again. YD period. So that would be the abbreviation for yards. Things your brain might picture if you're thinking about yards would be if you were to extend your arm, the length from your nose to the very end of your finger would be about a yard. Again, a yard is three feet put together. Maybe the length of a locker from top to bottom. Boys and girls, your backyard is measured in yards and a football field. For any of you that like football, they measure the field in yards. So those are some things that your brain could use to picture what a yard looks like. Again, because a yard is used to measure larger objects or short distances, you would use a yardstick or you could use a ruler. Let's review how many inches are in a foot. So remember, looking at a ruler, there are 12 inches in a ruler. That means that there are 12 inches in one foot.